Hey guys, how's it going? Dave here, bringing you another LCPDFR 1.0 British Patrol. And I haven't done much patrols for ages, like I think last week I did one, and that's because I'm still trying to get into the September schedule. It's going to be a bit difficult in the next few weeks or so, but I'll try and upload a few videos for you guys, so you're not left out. we got a, uh, how many people? This is our first call out, we've got a uh, bunch of... Uh, Troublemakers at the airport, so we're going to get there right now. I decided to do this in night time because I just want to do it in night time. And this is the Ford Focus 2014 Estate. It's not my model, and that's why it's got like tail lights and everything. If it was, I wouldn't give them tail lights, but it's still a nice car, and I think it deserves more attention. So I'm going to do a patrol in it, or maybe two of them this time around. I've got the uh, realistic siren and everything installed too. It's very difficult at the moment, like, you know, it's, uh, situations are complex and everything because it's a start term. I'm guessing it's the same for you guys as well. Like, you're probably trying to, like, you know, come on here, you can even watch so many videos or only play so much games, that sort of thing, because of the very busy schedule. And that's the same here, to be honest. So, I will still try making mods and probably reserve some days for that sort of thing. I ain't going on an out of action. That's one thing you, gotta, you guys got to remember. Um, I'll probably just, like, you know, Maybe I won't do a video every day, I'll probably just do one like, every two days or every three days, that sort of thing. But you'll still, I'll still try to give you guys like a few vids a week. Let's get here. Anyway, we are in control right now and let's uh, get the focus. I forgot to select set the uh, liveries on my taxis to like randomly change so they're all London's calling once. Hint, hint, join the clan, hint, hint. <laughs> Okay, um, this is my favourite part by the way, this uh, Cobble Street, it's like, you know, it's a bit like Camden Town. I think I've said that a thousand times already. You guys are probably sick of it. Uh, I'm using a siren distorter to get to this traffic. Oh yes, this is a nice car by the way, uh, like this Ford Focus. Uh, the skin is by myself. You notice on the uh, rear bumper there should be some text saying police on it, but there's, there was no UV map for the rear bumper so I had to put it on the... Uh, the actual body itself, not the plastic. Still next best thing. I haven't done one of these patrols in ages. Like, honestly. Quite a bit of time since I did my last patrol. See a bit more there, there we go. Okay, this is better, much better. Right, we'll, we'll uh, weave in and out of this traffic. Come on, let me through, for fuck's sake. The other coppers are so inconsiderate, they just don't move out of the way. Just no matter what you do, you can push them out of the way, they still won't move, they'll just put the handbrake on. These stubborn bastards. Let me through. See, I've just... It took me ages just to get around this silly little airport, and I don't want to cut corners and drive on the pavement, because that's just, just, just stupid, it's not realistic. In a real life, it damaged the bumper of the car, and, you know, the people at the garage would just go ballistic. What I'm probably going to do is I'm not going to say much when I'm responding so you guys can, you know, just watch my driving, that sort of thing. And all the really boring bits I'll tell you some interesting facts about the vehicle or what's going on or any updates in the channel, that sort of thing. That's the best way to do it. Uh, these guys here, just sitting on the uh, the wall. They ain't manned them on the wall, they're just a bunch of tramps. Go on, move on. Yeah, this is the airport and it's the middle of the night and there's no reason for you to be here, so jog on. And now these two guys as well, they look, they look really pissed. Come on, move on. Move on. Come on, get, get, out, of my, get out of my face, come on, get out of my sight. And as for you... Hey, come back here. I told you to move on. Stop him there, I'm going to give him a issue orders and ask him to move on. There we go. That was uh, taken care of uh, quite efficiently. Kind of radio into control that situation is uh, being dealt with. I'm back in the car. 
these are like the uh, new the new uh, incident response vehicles for the Met Police now like every single borough has them you know, that's, you know like the Astras years ago they used to be the most common vehicles in the streets well now it's these they're all over the place like you see them in police stations that incidents in fours, threes and fives and sometimes you see five of them and there's no such thing as a Hyundai or an Astra anymore you can hardly see any of them Weird, but yeah. I want to just want to let drunk. Oh, damn it! Drunk driver, disregard. That's one of the nastiest things that can happen to you. You get excited for some vehicle-borne pursuit, and then just have a big slap on your face. Sorry, you can't go there. Someone else is dealing with it. Notice in my latest videos, I only patrol that one certain area now, and this is an exception. Just like real police, so I'll just pick an area for patrol and stick around there. Like, sort of a precinct, I guess you could say. Who was that? What is that? I hear some sirens. Better check it out. What's going on here? What are they chasing? Gonna do a 360 and just uh, see. Well, 180 is not 360, but I was backing up, so I guess you could call it a 360. I'm going into the bus tip up for some reason. The, that bus is driving a bit too far. Oh, what the hell? The bus just collided in one of those uh, one of those supports. Oh damn! They're chasing the bus. What the fuck? Some random man man dem has just uh just jacked the keys on the bus and just decided to join some terrorist like you know transport route. It's terrorists. They've had, they've uh, stolen the bus. Yeah, this could be terrorism because it doesn't happen much. Don't we dare support for this thing? Because it's uh, really weird. So how the hell am I going to stop this thing? How are we going to stop this? This, 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 this bus is too tall. Like, you, just, you can't stop it with any cars. You probably need some sort of giant magnet to pick it up. Or just wait until it crashes. Alright, all right, I think I know what to do. I think I know what to do. I'm going to run in there and I'm going to pull him out of this bus. <laughs> Oh, get out of the fucking bus, you idiot. You know how to drive. And you've got, even got passengers as well. What the hell? Do I see people in there? This is terrorism. He's hijacked the bus. He's a fucking terrorist. Please, get out. Put your hands in your head now. Oh, oh my god. Uh oh. Okay, um, yeah, that's just when the pursuits start to get really good game crashes. <laughs> well, we dealt with them anyway. Let's get to this called out. Get rid of my withdrawal symptoms. Oh dear, what are we gonna do here? Just have to squeeze in through the traffic one by one. I'd usually turn left, but tonight I'm gonna be a bit of a dickhead and just go the right, like the long way round. <laughs> just park up beside here. There we go. Turn the lights off so don't freak out the residents. I don't know what the homeless people type of call out is supposed to be the equivalent in the UK. I think it's ASB, like, you know, chavs. In that case, they should um, replace the Tramp uh, player model with with uh, some freaky, like, Ali G dude in you know, track suits, that sort of thing. That'd be cool. Go on, jog on, mate. Matey, jog on. 
There was only one guy. There wasn't anybody else. I'm going to have a look through you anyway. I wish there was an animation so now when you have the pistol and you, you hold it up with your hands like that in the air, you could have that for the uh, for the uh, stick so that, you know, it's over your shoulder like in real life because whenever they arrive into a scene and they're running, they usually they hold it to their shoulder like that. The hell that was cheeky. Cheeky driving there, sir. Oh, we have passed the red light as well. It's a fixed penalty notice for him. I'm gonna embarrass him and show him up by turning the sirens on <laughs> in front of the traffic. That's one way to, you know, put someone in their place. Let's park up here. Right. There's a bit of an angle there, just in case he decides to get ASB over me. I'm gonna walk up here. Oh uh, yeah, you were uh, just hit over a pedestrian and went past a red light. Kind of don't need to see your license, so I'm just gonna add some points onto your taxi list. I'm also gonna give you a fixed penalty notice for dangerous driving. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's that's done. All right, let's go back in the car again. Lovely wig wags. Love ELS 8 because you wouldn't get that in ELS 7. They just like that look like plastic pieces of Lego stuck to the car. Just you know, stupid in general. Alright, we're on the main road, so we're waiting for trouble to happen. Oh, that guy skipped a red light, but it's not as if I care. I just pulled over somebody, so I'm going to do it again. It's way too boring for me, and it's way too boring for you guys. Ouch. Skipped past the red light again. The second time. I'd usually put him out of his car for that, but... Oh dear, we have a drunk driver. Let's go! I really don't like these tail lights on the car. We should get rid of them. The real thing doesn't have any lights in like the reverse lights or anything. It doesn't have any blues in there. It just, just has a light bar and that's it. Light bar, flashing headlights. I might make my own one version of these this car light in the near future. This is just like my Met set up with my new like, light bar and everything. Oh shit, we are miles away from this guy. I think we might lose him, but thing is, I'm trying to get there back, you know, the shortest way possible without breaking any severe traffic laws, like, just trying to be realistic, because there's no point in playing otherwise, I mean, once you, once you hit over people and start being silly and all that, oops, let's speak of the devil, as I was saying, once you do that, it just breaks the factor of the game and it doesn't become a simulation anymore, it just becomes some silly mess. I'm getting really hyper now. Oh, there he is. There's a vehicle. It's one of those BMW like three series or something. And, uh, trying to pull him over. I'm trying to call him the pursuit as well, but for some reason it's not working. I'm pressing Alt B and you know aiming at the car. Might have to do it the manual way. Shit, we've got active message. Oh bloody hell! That cop in front is doing nothing about it. Look, look absolutely nothing. He's got even gone into the cop, doing nothing. What an idiot. I'm not saying the driver's an idiot, but that cop is an even stupider idiot. And yay, we've lost him. I don't know how we've lost him, because I could have just got in the car and the marker would have stayed there, but... <laughs> I think it must be a fault with the game or something. Like, you know, one of those little script bugs or errors. I didn't mean to do that. I must have meant to press uh, Alt-E. I didn't mean to go to the computer. I'm going to go and chase for him. Like, look for him anyway. If I see a car just like that, I'll put it over immediately. Be quick. I think you turn left, so I'm gonna go down here. Okay, okay, he's miles away now. Forget about it. 
I'm going to take that armed robbery suspect and I'm going to take them. So I show myself up with one of those Nancy little taser thingies again against guys with AKs or something. I don't know what they're pulling out these days, but it sure ain't good. I like, wish there was like multiple liveries in the buses because I'm fed up seeing the same like you know bus company. <laughs> we could if we could have like Arriva, then we could have like first buses, and we could have uh, Metro Line, that sort of thing. Go ahead, London as well. That's quite a popular bus so in central London. What are these idiots doing? They won't let me pass. Is there a traffic jam ahead? Yeah, there is. Whoops. Okay, somebody's being inconsiderate here, so I'm going to squeeze in and just see what's going on. Oh, yeah. Out of the way, stop! I said stop! Look, look at this idiot, he's just staying there. Alright, guys, if I'm a, a uh, normal incident response vehicle, I'm not going to take the drug deal and progress call because they're usually armed. Like, I'll only take it if I'm feeling really brave. My colleague might sort them out, though. Come on, get out of the vehicle. Get the vehicle. This, this guy, it's this guy's fault. That's what he's doing. He's called us traffic jam. So I'm going to ask him to get out of the vehicle. So let's get the gun out. I'm using the gun just to get him out because there's no other like command to get him out with a asp or anything. All right, you're just blocking out the traffic, aren't you? You just don't want to, don't want to go. I just want to make it hard for everybody. So I'm going to give you a fixed penalty notice. Yeah, this is what I mean. Look, putting the uh, putting the stick on the shoulder like that. <laughs> That's really cool. Oh, oh shit, shit, what the hell? Another bus? Another crazy bus driver today? I'm pulling this idiot out. Get out of your fucking bus, you retard. What a retard. Okay, there's something's gonna. What the hell? Where's he gone? Where'd he go? Oh, he just disappeared into thin air. It's funny about this game, like, as soon as you take your eye off somebody, they're just gone. We'll get this guy, uh, go back into his vehicle again. Mm-hmm. Just get in my car. Where's my colleague coming? Go back up for her, and she can get in. Okay, I'm gonna be doing a few more rounds in this area, and then we'll call it a night. So, I don't know whether you guys prefer it, so I upload the night patrols at, like, evenings, and then the day patrols in the mornings, or in, like, 12 o'clock, or whether you just want me to upload every noon every day anyway it's to your choice just put down in the comments if you're interested and we'll see what I can do I'll probably just stick to my standard schedule anyway as soon as that's the best oh damn it another disregard how boring I hate it when it does that really like a wet blanket just takes the fun out of everything it's not that real life, so what would you expect? <laughs> quiet tonight. Very quiet. It's more quiet than a squeaker's TeamSpeak server. Oh well, I'm just gonna just gonna go back to the bottom of Hove Beach again. I'm not going to take that motorway because it'll take me to Alderney and that'll be out of my area. And as I said, I'm patrolling the same area recently. i still got to do the London road signs and everything. I'll probably find one of the days in a week to work on that project. Nope. Not the RVs. I'm not going to take that call. I know it's a very big thing to undertake. I'll uh, try and dig up my own files and uh, see if I can replace some road signs, make things interesting here and there. 
it's the road textures that I'm dreading the most because they take up a lot of work because you've got to go into like a thousand to two thousand files and replace them one by one you can't just get one command to replace all the road textures you've got to like manually do it using the uh, Windows Explorer and folders and everything in Photoshop and it's just hell it's really unpleasant so road textures will probably come much later than road signs but I might release the road signs to you guys that include the bus stops and everything and probably the uh, black traffic lights for you guys because it would be much more fun that way and the roads will just come back a little later on I mean I'm sure there's some really nice road textures out there already you could use those until you're waiting for mine and then maybe if we're really lucky in like say a few months time maybe I'll do some uh, city textures as well like uh, retexture some of the deli shops to be Nando's and Tesco's and stuff like that and then like you know get rid of a few stars and stripes and put some Union Jacks on there as well and then the game will just feel more British in general feel less tacky and like you know more realistic and that sort of thing Ooh, pursuit. I'm a drunk driver, I'm going to take that instead. It's more of an enjoyment factor. Ah, disregard again. So, so irritating. Go up here and see what's going on. Yeah, I didn't mean to press that in, just did by mistake. <laughs> Nothing much going on here. Usually, a lot of death domestic callouts were based in here back in like 0.95. Ooh, resisting arrest. Let's go. See all the blues in action. I'm going to turn my sirens off, sirens off at a junction so that we don't get any drivers wondering which direction the vehicle's coming from because I heard that's what they do. I'm going to take this road here. We need to really put, put the pedal down at the moment because he's miles away and this car ain't going to catch up anytime soon. That's the problem about the IRVs is they're not very fast so that's why they don't use them to put in pursuits as much as the area cars. And whenever I'm doing the handling of an area car, I make sure that it's fast. Like, it really is fast. Like, 0 to 60 in 5 seconds or 6 seconds. Sort of like the real version, because, I mean, the real police vehicles, they're tweaked. Whereas these cars, they don't care about performance. They just, you know, they just carry officers, that sort of thing. And because it's like, you know, London and everything, you don't need a high-performance vehicle, because it's usually to do with traffic and how congested the roads are. It's not like you know how fast a car can be that mean that determines if a vehicle's going to get to a call before another does, and that's why they used hatchbacks. I don't know why they use estates. But as I said like, quite a while ago, I'm guessing they use estates to cover up more land when they're blocking off a road. Oh shit! He escaped. Damn. See exactly what I'm talking about. That's why you don't use an IRV for pursuits. Well, I hope you enjoyed tonight's patrol, guys. I, I, I quite enjoyed it. <laughs> I haven't been playing this game for ages, like a whole week I haven't been in a patrol or anything, so... It's quite fun, quite new, so forgive me if uh, my driving was a bit off or anything, or I didn't know what key to press, but yeah. I'll try and get back into the hang of things again, but I can't guarantee anything, so while you're there, just thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, share, comment, subscribe, and join my Facebook group. And probably, yeah, if you want to follow me on Google Plus as well, just try that. I'll be the first people to follow me there because I think Google Plus is sort of underrated, even though it's a bit of a monster. And until then, I will catch you guys next time in another video.